doing personality psychology uh, this trimester. Okay. So very excited. And where are you studying? Uh, Deakin at Berwyn. Oh, fantastic. And how's that going? I love it, it's, even though I'm technically been there six years now. <laughs> it's such a great uni. That's where my son did his law degree. Amazing. And we I just, just had his graduation earlier in the year. It was so nice. I thought, yeah. wow, what a uni. They were giving out food today, like like a like a food bank. Like they had people lined up, like right. hundreds, but not just like for lunch, but like canned goods, fruit, vegetables, the whole thing. It was unbelievable. Oh, amazing. Yeah. I know, right? Yeah. So I'm well, for the graduation, they put on this beautiful lunch and everything. We all went. All the parents went and stuff. It was really nice. Yeah. yeah. Awesome. And I was so impressed with the buildings and everything. I know, right? Yeah. I'm glad to see you still have your pick here. Yeah, definitely. Yes. Now, how's things with you and the bladder? Now, oh. I got the message that you've gone up to the 50 milligrams. Yes, my GP mega. was able to do that. Yeah. Um, it's like hit and miss. So Is it? sometimes it's okay, but let's say eight out of 10 times it's not. Okay. Um, and it, it's definitely at the point where I'm hoping you'll put me on the waiting list for the surgery that we talked about. Like, I, I don't okay. know what else to do. Like, the pills are costing me. $66 for 30 so it's not like I can take double or anything yeah um, oh that's the maximum dose yeah. that you're on so just run me through a bad day like what happens oh a bad, on a bad day. day it's not empty and it's been bad this whole week so I'm sitting on the bathroom and it's almost like I'm doing squats like I imagine how a person would do having like babies like having to push and trying to get the last bits out but like I've been sitting there for ages I'm it feels like I've drunk like two liters of water for an ultrasound and yeah I've been sitting on the toilet for I don't even know how long and it, it's it's past excruciating it's okay it's like it feels full constantly okay and yeah like I said I'm lucky if I have a good day but I'm I'm having to like even walk my dog like much shorter because I can't risk going a, too far from the toilet yeah and it's um it's getting bad okay. and, and the pain is really bad is it yeah okay it's just it constantly feels full it never feels like it's emptying and this new sort of honestly the only way i can imagine it is it's like i'm having to push like you know like when you're wringing out a towel and you've got to it's, it's a nightmare okay now tell me about your medications what are you still on that sort of combination of the yeah. indepepalum the whole Lexapro thing, thing? Yeah. yeah okay yeah, definitely. and nothing nothing more since we started the no no i'm no. all on the same stuff as, as yeah. that i think my tarjan uh, amount has been like increased higher but that's it um yeah. but otherwise yeah all the same meds yeah but like I said, like when I first started, I'd have a couple of good days, but now it's just, my bladder hates me. Okay, all right. I tell everyone that. And tell me about the pain with your bladder. Like, when do you get it, pain? Uh, like, it's, it's like, how do I explain it? It's hard because I live in pain all the time. Yeah. But it is, it's like, you know, when you, it's that feeling of I've had to drink two litres of water and I'm not allowed to go to the bathroom. And it's just like, my insides feel like they're being like turned inside out. Like, like I'm being hit with baseball wraps, like from the inside, it's just unbelievable. Okay. And, and yeah. what do you do when it happens, when that pain gets really severe like that? Cry and yell, and yeah. not really anything effective, truthfully. Right. Try to have a hot bath, end up sitting on my toilet for God knows how long. Yeah. Um, Does the pain go away once you empty the bladder? It does if the bladder feels like it's empty, but lately it just won't feel like it's empty. So okay. the pain is just constant. Yeah. So like even driving to uni, driving here, having to drive home, like just the idea of, oh shit, I'm gonna get stuck in traffic, what's gonna happen? Like it's nerve broken. Yeah, because yeah. I, so you're sort of worried about it. I still have the fear yeah. of it's just going to explode somewhere. Yeah. And it's not fun. Like, I'm way too young to be worried about having to, like, you know, pee myself in front of public, you know. And, and but that, that's never actually happened. It hasn't happened, but the, the, the feeling like it's going to happen yeah. is a, like, lot, lot. Okay. And, and like I said, like, today isn't a great day, but it's, it's manage, I'm managing it to the best of my ability. But I also, I guess this probably doesn't help me generally, but I don't drink a lot to try and counteract it. And then I'm not getting enough water and I think that's stuffing me up in other areas. And yeah. it is sort of like I'm trying to compensate it by not drinking much. Like I've 
drunk almost no water today and I know that I need to be, but because I've got to drive places, it's it's a risk. Okay. That's how it feels anyway. All right. Well, look, I've tried, we've tried the sort of stock standard medication at both yeah. doses and that hasn't really helped us, but look, mm-hmm. it was worth a go. Oh, absolutely. Um, what I'm thinking I might get you to do before we sort of go a step further mm-hmm. is come through and just have a couple of drinks of water until you feel you need to go. Oh, yeah. I and need then, to go right now. If that do helps. you? Yeah, okay. Yeah, sure. And when did you last go? Right before I left the campus, so 20, 30 minutes ago or something. Okay. Yeah, so it still feels full? Oh, it's full as. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Well, what I might get you to do is come through, and we're going to just do a flow test. Now, what a flow test tells me is you're sitting just on a toilet, mm-hmm. all right, mm-hmm. and you pass your urine. It tells me what's a full bladder for you. Okay. And then we will do an ultrasound afterwards and just see what do you leave behind. Interesting. All right. Okay. So what I want to know is, is a full bladder just for you, a full bladder that really doesn't have much in it, mm. um, but it's sort of a constant feeling, or is it a full, full bladder that you're just taking the no, top No, I reckon off? it's the set, the first one you see. Yeah. It feels like, like I'll have a cup of coffee, for example. I'll go to the bathroom, have coffee, and I'll need to pee in between and at the end. Like it's yeah. only like, like I said. Because so I then pee. I know where I'm sort of directing my yeah, next yeah, yeah. level of care. So in other words, I put you on medication to see if we could relax your bladder and mm-hmm. hold on to more. Mm-hmm. But I've used one... I've got to be a bit careful because you've got some others and we talked about that, about yeah, the yeah, drug yeah, interactions and being very careful about drug interactions. Yeah. Um, so if this one hadn't done anything and hasn't increased the capacity of your bladder, we might be better off than moving to something like the Botox yeah. to your bladder, um, which will help a lot more because it's not going to have those drug interactions. Yeah, you know, yeah. whereas some of the others that we've got available, we've mm. just got to be careful, particularly with your epilim and your endep. Oh, my epilim's gone up, if you need to know Has that. it? Okay. Yes, yeah. sorry, I forgot. So I was taking 2 and 200. Yeah. Now I'm taking 200 and 400. Okay. Um, and is that for this pain? Well, it's for all over mood, like keeping me. It's re- I'm feeling the best I've ever felt in my life, like right. mentally and emotionally. Physically, my body hates me all over. Yeah. But um yeah, like I like I said, I mean, do you want to do that thing today or is yeah, it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So or? I'm gonna get you to bring yeah, your yeah, things yeah, through yeah, and yeah. then I'll get I'll show you where the drinking fountain is. Do it while you're here. Yeah, yeah, okay. Cool. And then 